Hey, hey, fellow YouTubers, JJ the Trucker coming to you from Texas, Amarillo, Texas, specifically, and hopefully you can hear me, I'm not being too loud because I'm in a restaurant. Check it out. That place look familiar to anybody? That's right, it's the Big Texas Steakhouse. Oh man, all right, so look, I know it's been a while since there's been a video out. I'm sorry, I've been busy, but you know what? You never too busy. I repeat, never too busy for the Big Texas Steakhouse here in Amarillo, Texas. And yes, Lyle, I'm talking to you specifically because uh, Lyle, you know, he, he's all all work. I, unless he's taking like his month of home time. Other than that, he's all work. And uh, he doesn't stop and smell the roses. Once he's out on the road, he just busts out those miles. And, and he specifically mentioned... I don't stop and do this. I don't stop and do that. I don't even stop at the Big Texas Steakhouse or in whatever. And I'm like, what? And he's like, I don't have time for that. I'm like, you always have time for the Big Texas Steakhouse. Yes, you do. So, uh, but anyways, but still, Lyle's awesome. Check out his channel, uh, No Hippie Trucking and Transport. I'm sure you already do. If you if you follow me, I'm sure you follow him too. If you don't, why not? He's awesome. Um, so, anyways, uh, busy busy in fact I'm gonna keep this pretty brief uh, let's see last I left you uh, I was on the side of the road in Oklahoma uh, got busted uh, for, for speeding in a work zone yep uh, in fact um, Prime actually uh, gave me a call uh, for my driving award as they call it uh, they would like to uh, to honor me and have me come on into a terminal yes uh, for for my award that I got from uh, from the fine people in uh, Oklahoma, uh, the Oklahoma troopers there, uh, they want to have a, a meeting in my honor, uh, more like a class in my honor, uh, to give me the opportunity to learn more about safety. <laughs> yeah, they're they're pulling me in for a safety class, but they're not routing me directly, and it wasn't a serious violation or anything. Uh, but they said, yeah, since it was in a work zone, they do want me to come in for a safety class. And you know what? I don't. I, I understand that. I, I can't blame them at all for that. So, uh, anyways, it is what it is. Uh, but man, where have I been? So I finished that uh, that that uh, delivery in Oklahoma. Uh, picked up another one the next day. Went out to Salt Lake City. Made that delivery. Uh, did a 34-hour reset at the terminal where I actually shot another video. And it was supposed to be a really good video because as I'm pulling in uh, to the terminal, they found a screw in one of my drive tires. Yes, my tire got screwed. Ah, uh, man. So uh, they went ahead and, and got that patched up, and I had the video shot of them doing that, rotating my tires uh, directly off the rim and everything. It was uh, it was a cool video, and, and it was just, I thought I was going to have time because I was doing a 34. I ran out of time. I had other stuff that had to get done. So it didn't get done. I never got that video edited, and I, I'll, I'll try one of these days to maybe get that done. But I think I bit off a little more than I could chew because I had diff different bits and pieces and camera work and all kinds. I was just going crazy. I thought I was going to have all this time. I didn't. So anyways, got that taken care of. Ran into John, uh, Trucker John, while I was there. Finally ran into him. First time I'd ever run into him. I've uh, known him since uh, since before he started with Prime. Uh, he used me as a referral. Uh, that was awesome. So thank you, uh, and it was awesome meeting him. Uh, so make sure you check out Trucker John's channel. Uh, he is. If you're, let's put it this way. If you're wondering if you can do this job and you have a family, okay, you got a wife and kids or spouse and kids, whatever, check out his channel. See what he has been doing because he's got a spouse and kids and he is absolutely making it work so oh check it out view look at nobody's doing the challenge right now uh 72 ounce steak challenge by the way if you finish off 72 ounces of steak plus a dinner salad and two sides and a dinner roll within one hour it's free free so anyways moving on um after salt lake went to uh twin falls idaho from Twin Falls, Idaho, down to Reno, from Reno to Winnemucca, uh, Nevada, uh, where there was a DMV that I went to, because uh, guess what? I got my, has my hazmat endorsement. Yes, I'm hazmat certified, baby. Got my endorsement. Uh, passed the test of flying colors. Woo, that's one thing I was really busy doing, studying. That is a, not an easy test. But passed it with flying colors, got that, uh, that endorsement. 
uh, deadheaded out to Santa Rosa, California, uh, Northern California, picked up a load there uh, that is taking me all the way here to Texas. And I'm delivering tomorrow night, uh, Central Texas. Whew, all right. Um, that's pretty much the update. Wow. Uh, as far as what I'm doing here, I'm eating, of course. Well, no, I'm not eating yet. I ordered my food. It's not here yet. Um, I'm, I've, I've tried a few things here because uh, I do like to stop here. I've already done a video here and everything. Uh, so you probably have already seen that. But this time I, I went ahead and tried the, I'm going to try the uh, their ribs. I love me some ribs. I am a connoisseur of ribs, pork ribs specifically. Beef ribs are good. I'll do beef ribs. But pork ribs are definitely some of my favorites. Um, I used to work at Tony Roma's. Um, if you're not familiar with them, oh yeah, they've got baby back ribs and um, and St. Louis style ribs. Uh, four different sauces, really good uh, for a chain. Okay, but I've really had grown an appreciation for ribs, especially lived in St. Louis, uh, traveled to uh, Kansas City at their uh, their barbecue. I've done Tennessee. Uh, and there are barbecue. I've, I've had ribs from all over the place. Even had ribs in Winnemucca when I was up there. They were okay for the area. I mean, northern Nevada is not really known for barbecue. Um, it, it, they were okay. They, they were St. Louis style ribs, but they're they're all right. Uh, but let's try them here at the Texas Steakhouse. And um, hey, my next video, I'll let you know how they go. All right, I will talk to y'all on the flip side. Later. Thank you for watching this feature presentation from me, JJ the Trucker. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up or two. I'd appreciate it. That way I know which videos you guys are enjoying. And you know what to do now. That's right. That's right. You see it right there. Click on my face. Click on my face. See what happens when you click on my face. You know you want to. Other than that, check out some of my other videos for more great content, such as the one YouTube's recommending, the one I'm recommending, or for more free JJ the Trucker merch. Check out the other video. Later.